Hey everybody, Micah, Outdoor Living Guy. Another Tuesday tip for you here. We're in a beautiful outdoor living space. We got the beautiful outdoor kitchen and bar. So when you're thinking about this, and this is your Tuesday tip, is adding a bar to the space. First of all, strongly find a spot for you, a bar. That's tip number one. Number two is if you have a lot of windows looking into the outdoor living space like we do here, you can see all of these windows and all of these windows. So a lot of people think of outdoor kitchen, but this little bar and all it is is just an extension with the granite. You're getting granite or a solid surface anyways. So just extending it, you can see that it's open underneath. By the way, that's added to this Tuesday tip is think about keeping it open. sides this, this is like an l-shaped house with a courtyard they all look into the space so seeing it through the windows and having this be solid is a little bit too much of an eye stop so keep that open keep your eye flowing to the beauty that's this you can't see it behind the camera is a beautiful fireplace but that's a nice little feature so a bar is great keep it open because of the sight lines from the house looking into the space this is a very traditional kind of covered structure with wood with wood beams which is really cool but adding just a spark of contemporary bar adds a different feel to the space so you can see underneath we put some steel frame and then we just put some cable in to just add that little bit of modern element and it really just spices up the outdoor living space when i'm working from home that is where i'm sitting all day um, Part of it's covered in the shade, so if I'm ever wanting like a Zoom call or something and I can't have sunlight, I'll be sitting over there. Once my Zoom call's over, head over to the other side of the bar and I'm able to catch some sun, just do a little bit of work. And Yeah, I've enjoyed being able to, like, I love, I think I'm gonna have to take Kim's idea. I love that um, having bar stools on both sides, but I love that we can be on this side here, or we can be on this side and out this way. It's been great. You can socialize as ever you want. So yeah, I love it. A bar and outdoor space is an absolute must. Here we have it where it's open at the bottom. So it does visually give you the ability to kind of see through and keep the space open but it's a magnet for people to come hang out at. So right behind camera is a hot tub. So you can imagine people in the hot tub hanging out, talking with people at the bar, but really what you have here with the TV is the ability to swivel that TV for the people in the hot tub, for the people at the bar, or even on the far side over by the green egg here, you can be hanging out over there and swivel the TV and watch that. Hope you enjoyed this little tip. If you have any questions, please comment below. I'll try my best to answer them or uh, recommend what you would like to see in a tip and I'd be happy to try my best to do it. All right guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like.